Hey, this is John Sanmez from simpleprogrammer.com. So I've got another question for you today. Uh, this one is about, uh, is kind of for, the, for you newbies out there that are wondering how to get kind of started in the field. So uh, this question is from Alex and he says, Good day, John. As you suggested in my previous email, I'm sending you a couple of questions uh, so you could do a video. Thanks for your help. Uh, so he's actually got a couple of questions here. So uh, what would be the first steps for a computer science student or just graduate to find a job in the field? Um, and then is there any opportunity to find a job that is not an inter internship for young gradu graduates or in the process of graduating? Uh, and then how to fight not having experiment experience in your resume when uh, it's almost always a requirement. Uh, those are my concerns. At least this can give you an idea to go deeper into the topic. Thank you so much. So these questions are, there's three separate questions here, but they're all really the same question. It's, it's basically this question of how do you get a job without any experience just graduating or, or getting ready to graduate, you know, a real job, not an internship. Uh, so there's, you know, obviously there's always this catch 22 is that you have to have experience uh, to get a job and you have to have a job to gain experience. So how do you do this? Uh, I, I've talked about this actually a, a lot in, in different videos and in different ways, but the biggest thing that you can do is, you know, again, I was just talking in, in another video about, about how we're kind of moving to this entrepreneur type of, of civilization where more and more people are being entrepreneurial. Well, you can now, especially with mobile apps, this is one of the cool things as a software developer is you can build your own mobile app company or even web app company, right? And just build one or two apps. You don't need a whole team. You don't need a huge thing to build a company, right? So you can actually build your own job and gain experience. So if you're in college right now, if you're in university and you're studying computer science and you want to be able to get a job when you get out, we'll start creating a job for yourself now. So, you know, it's not going to have the same kind of uh, prestige as, as working for maybe a bigger company, but start your own company, build a couple of mobile apps, right? Or build a web app, build, have some kind of app that you've built, some kind of software that could potentially make money on its own, right? So, I mean, there's, there's going to be multiple roads here. You maybe, maybe you'll build some kind of app and it'll do really well and you won't even have to work for someone else. Maybe you'll be able to build a whole business out of that and that would be, be awesome. But even if that doesn't happen, I mean, because it's, 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 it's less likely to happen, right? Especially if you're doing this part-time. What will happen is, uh, is that if you graduate from college and then you have experience, like you can say, look, if you go to this website, I built this application and I'm selling it for $30 a month or whatever it is. Um, or you, you can say, oh, look on the app store and you can see this iOS or this uh, Android app that I built you can go ahead and show that to an employer and they're going to look at that and they're going to say, wow, you actually have experience. So you're going to get past that catch, catch 22, right? Because you will have experience. Yes, it won't be experience working for someone else's company, but does it really matter, you know, on your resume? And, and do you even have to report who's the owner of that company? I mean, you could literally just put on your resume this company that you've created and you could be working for that company part time or or whatever it is. And if you have a legitimate company because you've built a little legitimate product, then then you know that might not even really matter, right? So it, it, at least you're going to look a lot better than all of those similar college graduates that don't have any experience. They're just totally green. They don't have anything like that. You know, it, it's going to still take some time, right? To 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 build up that. That experience and build up that resume but this is a great start and plus like i said you've got this added bonus of maybe you can go an entrepreneurial route maybe you don't even need a job for someone else maybe especially if you're just beginning in college maybe by the time that you've gone through your four years of college you've built an actual business for yourself by going this route using your skills you know the biggest fear that an employer has is that when they hire you you can't actually write code and there's an amazing number of software developers that come out of college with four year degrees and they actually don't know anything. They can't actually write code. They may have learned a lot of book knowledge, but they can't actually write code. So if you can actually demonstrate that you can write code in good code, that's shippable, you know, a shippable product, 
that's going to give them a lot of confidence. It's going to put you, it's, it's going to alleviate a lot of those fears. So that's, that's the big thing is just, you know, how can you build up experience on your own? You don't need someone else to do this. Today, you can create a company easily. You can put apps in the app store. You can sell things online. I mean, it's amazing how easy it is to, to take payments with payment processors like Stripe and PayPal and all this, you know, it used to be hard. You used to have to like go and, and go to the bank and set up a merchant agreement and get a, you know, to be able to swipe credit cards and all this. It's so simple now. Anyone can can do this this kind of stuff. So you, you should be doing it if if you really are serious about you know getting out there and, and getting a job right away when you get out of college. All right. Well, I hope that is helpful to you. Best of luck, uh, and uh, and hopefully you you get a, a nice job that's not an internship. When, when you get out of college. If you have a question for me, just email me at john at simpleprogrammer.com. If you feel like this video might benefit someone, I'd appreciate it if, you, if you'd share it. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Take care.